Hello there everybody. Welcome back to another fishing video. Today is going to be a quick one and it is how to tie a teaser head. Teaser heads, they look like this. Okay, so it comes, uh, so this is primarily used for uh, baiting anchovies for that, uh, for ocean trolling for Chinooks and uh, any salmon. Okay, and uh, once you're done, they look like something like this. Okay, so it comes in a assorted amount of uh, colors. Okay, so we got this green one here. We got uh, this orange one, and you also have this glow. We're we'll definitely switching up to more glow this year. So I don't know if you can see that. That's pretty cool, eh? So there you go. So this is a UV. This has nothing on it other than paint. So it's probably fancy for the eyes, but to me, glow. You gotta go with glow. Okay, so this is what it looks like right there. That's a teaser head, an anchovy teaser head. Okay, so we have the anchovy teaser head there, and we have a number four treble hook. Okay, we're gonna be pinching those barbs. And then we have a three finger gap right there and then we have our single hook four rot at the very end okay and then we're also going to be using 40 pound monofilament line okay and generally you want an arm to arm length right there to the bottom of the hook and uh, that's basically it first thing let's get some line let's go ahead and get our number our four rot hook don't forget to pinch those barbs, guys, because uh, I don't know what kind of regulations you guys got, but in our area, definitely pinch barb. Okay, let's go ahead, bring that line through the top. Give yourself about an, an inch past, okay? And then we're gonna wrap this up one, two, three times, okay? One, two, three, maybe four, okay? So take this. Let's try. Let's do it again. Yeah. Uh, one, two, three, four. Take that end right there and put it through that eyelet. Boom. Same idea as the other one. Okay, now we got this two in parallel and the other one we'll just keep wrapping. One, two, three, four. Maybe we'll go five. And nothing left now but to lubricate. And take that line, push it, pull it up. Okay. Notice that I'm kind of filtering the line as it goes through. So we don't tangle. Okay. Go ahead and go. Okay again. There it is. Another bait loop done. Okay, right there. Okay, get a treble. Right here, go through the hole. Okay, bring it down. So now, right here, give yourself a three finger gap. Something like that. Uh, that's about right. Okay, so let's do that again. Okay, let's do a little wrap back here. Let's give it three yourself. Uh, three, one, two, three, maybe four. Okay, so pinch that assembly. Take your other end and go through that eyelet. Okay, and go ahead and pinch everything together. Okay, so effectively that's what you have right now okay and what you want to do is kind of hold that put your finger in the pockets there keep it tight and keep wrapping keep yourself uh, another three four wraps one two three four we'll go with five so lubricate take that top end pull it through you notice how my you notice how my pinky is always filtering the lines coming in 
Okay. There you guys have it. Okay, there you guys have it. Effectively, we have another bait loop. And we're gonna tie in the whole line up. Okay, so let me show you guys the other bait loop that we made. Right there, guys. We have now made two bait loops. So you river angler should be familiar with this one. Okay, so let's go ahead, put that down. Next thing, we're gonna be approaching from the flat side of the teaser head. We're gonna go through the toothpick hole. Okay. And then immediately after that, there is a slotted hole right in front of it. And then we're gonna go cut across the head. Maybe pull that pin out so it's not out of the way. Okay, so we're gonna go through there and we're gonna try and aim a diagonally across through the nose of the teaser head right there. Okay, so right away, let's get our line straightened out so there's no tangle right there. So effectively, we went through the back side, through the slotted hole, okay, and then through the head into the nose, okay? So it's pretty easy guys, all you gotta do now is yank that straight through, and voila, we are done. Let's take that pin back, put it back on that holder, and boom, we're done. There you go guys. So the only thing left now is to uh, put a toothpick right there, so I'm gonna leave you guys a, a video at the very end uh, to show you how to put that anchovy in there, just like so, okay? So give yourself, so give yourself an effective arm to arm length, okay? And we're gonna attach a swivel on that end, and then we're gonna wrap it around our leaderboard and put a little button head pin to finish it off, okay? Just like so. Okay, let's go ahead and try that again. This time we're gonna be using our herring teaser heads. So this one's slightly larger, larger size. We have the same idea, except we're gonna be going through the nose right here, exactly on the nose. And there's also another one up top. So you can go ahead and choose which one you like. Let's go ahead and go through the back end. I've never actually used one of these guys, so I'm gonna attempt it. It looks very similar. Okay. Now, let's go through the inside. There we go. There we go. It's a little tricky, but we got it in. Okay, there you guys have it. We are done. This time we have an ancho, uh, a herring teaser head done up, quite bigger than the other. So let's just clean up the tag ends and snap that off. Okay, and then let's get our pin back to our unit. Okay, I'm gonna put a little swivel at the very end. And here we go, another arm to arm length setup. We're gonna finish it off with a swivel just like we did uh, this one, and then we're gonna be wrapping it up on our leaderboard. It's good to have your stuff pre tied, guys. It's just uh, less hassle out there. So, okay. Let's go ahead and put that button pin in. There you go. There you guys have it. Another teaser head done and ready to slay some fish. Okay. Anyways, good luck out there, guys. And uh, if you guys like this video, please do like, share, and subscribe. Please let me know how I'm doing. Uh, if I did something wrong, maybe you guys have a different way of tying things. Leave a comment below. Le read the description for links. Join my Facebook fishing group. Fishing is my happy place. All in the link description below, guys. Tight lines. Have a fishing. See you guys on the next fishing video. So here it is, guys. I got my pre-tied teaser heads. The pickling salt seems to do the trick. These are heads, take this pen, put it in the eye, right in the nose, and then just put it straight through just like that. And then some people use a treble right here. So I'm gonna just use my setup right now. Put it there, and you got this pin right here to regulate the tension of the curve. So that death roll right there. Just wants to do the trick.